Hey guys, I want to review a uh, limiter grid tied inverter that I recently got to run my solar panels and currently without batteries, but will get batteries. Uh, I had some of these cheap uh, Chinese inverters and uh, this is actually one of them, but this is a higher grade one. Uh, does very good. I like it a lot. Uh, unfortunately, I did a review on Amazon where I got it, and the seller is like not selling it anymore. Even though he sold one, I was the only uh, buyer. Apparently, didn't like my very review. Though I liked it a lot, and wish he'd sell more. Uh, this is a thousand watt. Uh, version they make a 2000 watt one which I could have taken uh, and you could get it 120 or two um, 240 connection but which what I would like to add actually uh, I think America should switch from 120 get rid of the stupid uh, switch uh, split box where you have to split between two 120 volt uh, versions and what, go European and go 240 and just have one damn panel and not split the stupid load. You have uh, two wires coming off the, the, uh, the road instead of having three. That's the expense right there. Plus, you have to split the stupid thing, so this inverter can only go on one side. I have the 120 uh, volt version, and so this particular inverter will only go on one side of the split panel, which is super stupid. I would have to get two of them in order to cover all my loads. So what I did was, I actually... Can't see it here. I don't have lighting down in my basement, but I moved all my panel, all my circuitry to one side. And then whatever was on the other circuit, I just flipped off. So I have nothing on the half of the split circuit. So this inverter will t pick up and convert. Anyways, this one, this particular grid tied. Uh, inverter has a has a uh, sensor that I put on to the side that I have all my load on and uh, and in order to monitor it I bought this nice cheap Wi-Fi cam so I could view it I might try to do a screenshot on it if I could add it to the video of the cam so I could because I'm on the second floor I don't want to walk down two flights of stairs to see what the hell's going on so right now on a very cloudy winter day I'm making 172 volts or watts uh, with a I have actually uh, 1300 watts of solar panels and uh, this is even though it says a thousand watt inverter it actually only makes up to uh, a uh, 900 I wish they get their damn Chinese story straight so if you could see this number here that's my voltage coming off my panels this this little number here, 169, is actually what's coming off the grid. I'm using that. Normally it would be zero, but being on a cloudy day, I'm only making 179 volt watts right now. And uh, so I could view this anytime upstairs. With this, this is a Wi-Fi, and this actually is very good 
uh, cam. It's a uh, the YI cam for a hundred forty or not a hundred forty four dollars uh, because this does not have a remote sensor on it whatsoever, so I could view this and I could change this. I could run this off directly off the panels like I am, or you could do it by battery, which I'm going to do eventually, and uh, probably have a switch so I could switch between directly off the panels to the batteries at night. And so you you don't you can't do much on this thing, but I can if it will change. It's not changing great. Oh well, I was gonna see. That's where my uh, I could change it to the battery and tell what voltage is on it. I haven't played with that much since I have not have a battery. And <laughs> this is odd, I cannot change it. Normally I could change that, but I cannot. There's the voltage, I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's, uh, Very weird. Huh. This is very... Oh, my goodness. Oh, well. This stupid thing is not doing what I want to. Oh, great. Now I can't get back to where I was for this stupid thing's not working. I should be able to flip around on that thing. Anyways, this is what I was using before. I had two of these, and these are 500. They're supposed to be 600 rated per uh, unit, but of course... Chinese always overestimate what the hell they do, and this only actually makes 500 at most, 600 watts. I never got 600, only got 500 out of my 1,300 watts of solar panels. And the it's supposed to be a MPPT uh, inverter, which... The MPPT actually sucks major time. This one is also an MPPT inverter. This one works really well. I could actually, uh, I've seen the voltage off the panels up to uh, 34, 34 volts where on the other cheap inverter, it would go drop it all the way down to 24 volts no matter what you put in I'd actually set put my panels to 48 volts it dropped it all the way down to 24 stupid major dumbs so if you want a grid tied a cheap grid tied inverter buy these these are awesome I would recommend these highly only $300. I could have bought a 2,000 watt one for $500. And I probably should have, but I figured since I had a freaking split panel goddamn American electric panel, I probably had to buy two of these. So I was going to, you know, eventually if I had to, is buy a second one and, and put it on the other side. Uh, so, I, let's see, so I hope you enjoy this, got something out of it, um, I like this a lot and I'll probably leave a, the Amazon link to it so you know exactly what it is because it's a, basically a no name brand type deal, 
All right. I appreciate it. Thanks.